4829 Whispering Spring. You can park on this side of the street that we're on. You cannot park on the other side of the street. That's nice for this particular home because it makes the neighborhood feel more spacious. And I will say the neighborhood did feel especially spacious coming in, um, but it doesn't restrict the parking for this particular home. There is grass. We'll see what Jenny has to say about that. Okay, there are two cats in the house. <laughs> And I don't want them to get out, so I'm going to be very careful. Screen doors are great. Uh, Jenny loves them. Thank you. Jenny loves them because some tenants feel a lot safer having them. And uh, then they can leave the door open, let the breeze come in, don't have to worry about animals or kids getting out. So the counters are laminate, but they look to be in good shape. Cabinets are fine. We have tile, that's great. Walls are yellowy, good condition overall. It's nice that we have hard flooring throughout the first floor. We have the two and a half inch full blinds over there, which is great, plus the valance. So it gives an upgraded feel, upgraded fixtures. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go to the backyard very quickly so the cats don't get out. Oh, there's oh she's trying to get out. Never mind. I don't I don't want to be responsible for the cat getting out. Uh, so we do have concrete in place, which is uh, good. It's a little small, so we'll need Jenny's opinion on that. But as you can see, it didn't stop them from setting up two barbecue grills. There are chairs here, so definitely a Jenny call. It's about 3 p.m. So it does get the evening sun. There is no patio overhang. But the rock is filled with, I'm oh, sorry, the yard is filled with rocks and uh, we do have some minimal landscaping so it requires just a little bit of maintenance but it's enough to give a nice feel to the home. We don't have two-story neighbors uh, directly behind us which is nice, gives a little bit of privacy. Plus we can take advantage of the neighbor's greenery by not having to uh, maintain them and yet it gives privacy and uh, it's pretty. Okay, so let's head into the next room. Oh, let's see. Pantry, of course. Yeah. Sorry it's so dark in here, but from what I can see, the paint condition is good overall, as is the flooring, but of course there's a rug and furniture. Great blinds, and they do have blinds up there, even though we don't necessarily need them. Sorry, uh, they have upgraded the bathroom. We have nice tiles throughout. It's really dark, so I don't know if you can tell, but that's in fine condition. Upgraded light fixture, picture mirror, uh, normal closet. So Jenny likes when the laundry room is not in the pathway of the garage or other rooms. It's just a separate room off to itself where you can hang clothes and close the door, like in this situation. So that's a plus. upstairs. The carpet may need to be replaced. It's not in top condition and it's a little dated, but it's only on the stairs. That's just over a dollar a square foot, not a large expense. So far from what I've seen upstairs, the flooring looks great. Upgraded light fixture, decent sized room. Paint and flooring look good. Tile, nice. 
laminate counters, but in good condition. Same um, carpet that was on the stairs. Lines look good. <laughs> Tile, laminate, cabinets look good. My fixture's fine. So, as you can see, there's a rug covering most of the flooring. Okay. Not the best paint job here. But because it's a kid's bedroom, it may be okay. Let's see what Jenny says. And that's the house.